Have y'all been seeing all the drama with the whole thing with Stunner Girl and her Stunner Girls? I'm not even gonna lie. I like Stunner Girl, but I could. I, I just knew this was gonna happen. Like I knew that that shit was gonna be full of shit. Definitely because she had that guy Moolah with her, and he just looked dumb. I just don't understand who would even really do business with Stunner Girl because. Knowing the type of person that she is, y'all know that when she get mad, she gonna put everything out there, whether it's true or not. She gonna talk down bad about you, just like she did the cast members from her show, um, the two twins. That's right there with the blondes. They made a whole like ten part series on their TikTok about all the things that they endured from Stunner Girl, her production, and the whole cast. Okay, they were saying that like basically the show was not what it was given and that stunner girl basically was not giving what it was supposed to be gave the girls were in a mansion house that only had four bedrooms or five bedrooms only four of them for the cast because obviously one of the bedrooms for stunner girl that stunner girl stayed in the room the whole time um they was out there basically fighting for their lives fighting to the death of them i mean <laughs> i just cannot they said that stunner girl kept on bringing up natalie and how like comparing their show to natalie and them show the baddies saying that oh this is what i have to do to to get where i am da, 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 and y'all got it good and da, 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 but they wasn't really making no money and none of the girls can get paid unless they finish the show so if you go on the show and you fight you find the first two three days but you go home on the fifth day you don't get paid because you didn't stay the whole time mind you the twins have been going on for days like when i first seen this this was the other day i had screenshot all of it and i was like trying to keep up but it was just so much shit because all the cast members start coming out you can tell which cast members are the ones that's like dick riding stunner girl and then you can tell the ones that's really genuinely like no nah, that lady crazy like 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 she really had us fucked up but again this is another reason why i feel like we should already knew that the show was going to be all over the place because they started off with the like red rum whatever on that network and then with her and moolah got broken up or whatever divorced and she went to like this look look you look you look at you a platform and now she got like the lux network I, I don't know it's just all over the place like the whole thing has been all over the place you don't even know really where you can find it and i'm not gonna pay 599 to watch the show so honestly i have not tuned in i don't know what the fuck really went on the show i can only go off what the girls are saying because i'm not gonna pay 599 for no show that's being bounced around from different networks and one of the twins made a really good point they kept talking about breach of contract breach of contract but like one of the twins said originally the contract was under the red rum or red whatever whatever the first network was it was under that and now is under a whole nother one so the contract kind of does go out the window right wouldn't that make sense girl the topia twins whatever their names is they didn't got in contact with natalie nunn and natalie nunn over there trying to give her little tips and stuff y'all can pause to read but this is a page y'all should go tune in to all the series to get all the tea i'm telling y'all it was a lot like they put a lot out there and if you go literally look on the other cast members page they all still going they all act like little stunner girls there's always yap yap yapping and let me know if y'all actually tuned into the show let me know in the comments what y'all think do y'all think the girls are lying i personally believe it anybody who knows stunner girl who has watched her you know blossom into the woman she is today you know that a lot of things they're saying definitely sound like stunning girl even the part where they said that they got evicted out of the the house that wasn't inside of uh, the bel-air i guess it was in beverly hills and they end up taking the rest of the cast members to vegas to stunning girl's house to the trap they saying that where stunning girl put rocky bad in the cage now if she still has that trap house where she put rocky bad in, in the uh, cage that trap house has been around for a, a little bit of time now so i'm just like this is crazy 